All right, guys, I'm just going to make a quick video here about my Mosin Nagant, or Nagant, however you want to pronounce it, uh, ATI scope mount. Available here on CheaperThanDirt.com. This is it. That is the available price right now. Um, I have mounted on here as a uh, 4 to 12 Pentax scope. Here is the mount itself. I sawed it off about an inch off the end because it, it wasn't needed and it was kind of in the way lo loading the bullets. Um, there's the bolt handle that comes with it. Um, and yeah, so I, I've shot it about a hundred times now and I haven't been too happy with it. Um, to begin with, the installation was horrible. Uh, drilling and tapping the screws into the receiver. Uh, trying to get the uh, the alignment right so it'd be straight with the gun on that round receiver it was very hard and in fact we got it wrong as you can see on this side of it here those little pieces of metal right there I, I cut aluminum out of a, uh, a coke can to use as shims to shim my scope to get it straight because the the adjustments were uh, so much needed that I couldn't I couldn't get it with the with the clicks, so that was bad. Um, I put heavy duty uh, scope rings on there that was supposed to go on black uh, black powder rifles, you know, and so it's supposed to be pretty heavy duty. And I believe it still kind of slips a little bit, which might be throwing it off. But I'm pretty sure it's the uh, the mounting because there's only two screws. There's one here and one here in the center of this black rail right there. The bolt handle uh, was, uh, it's a great shape and everything, but you, as you can see, there's one screw <laughs> that screws into it, and the rest here is a weld. I had to weld it on there, sand it smooth, uh, file it smooth, and uh, because it, every time you, you worked it, it was okay for like five shots, and then after that, it, it would move every single time. And so that was not up to par. You would think they would put two screws into it to really tighten it down but they only give you one and so I uh, <clears throat> went shooting recently and I'm going to show you these two targets here uh, this first target you can see the pink highlighted X's those are the uh, those are the bullet holes from the the Mosin Nagant the others are from a 22 rifle I had also and um, this was just shooting around this was just uh, you know just as fast as I could shoot it not really you know, holding and taking my breath and, and squeezing one off, you know, he's just shooting them as quick as I can get it on target, just playing around, having fun with it. I shot uh, about 40 rounds, I believe, on this one. Um, a few in the black, none on bullseye, of course. And then the rest were uh, just kind of on paper there. And then this next paper here, I actually took my time and I, I tried to get it right on bullseye and was just trying to get it as accurate as possible. And both of these are at 100 yards, by the way. And so, uh, again, pink, uh, pink highlighted X's are the Mosin Nagant holes. The rest are uh, 22. I shot 10 shots at this target. And as you can see, there's one, two, three, four, four out of 10. I told my girlfriend I was shooting with that if I, I could get all ten of them within the black ring, I would be happy with it. But I didn't. I got two, two out of ten. I was very, very unhappy with that. And uh, I'm really considering just taking, taking the scope mount off, just going back to the iron sights, you know, holding that up at a at, uh, hundred yards, doing ten shots, and just holding it as accurate as I can, and, and squeezing ten off, and seeing how well it would do on target like that compared to the scope because it's obviously moving around it's it's not as accurate as it should be I, I believe a gun like this this long of a rifle and it's the full the full length rifle not the short m44 or whichever the others are called it should be pretty accurate it should be able to put them i would say at least in the second ring and this is i don't know a 12 inch a 12 inch diver circle here so not too happy with it um Paid sixty for the scope, and I don't know what forty, forty or fifty for the mount. You know, all together, shipping and everything. So that is my review. That is what it looks like. Bolt handle is great though. Once you weld it on, that's 
Thanks for watching.